So we've just taken our first cut on this new spindle here. Now, this was not with a diamond tool. This was just with a very, very sharp, razor sharp carbide insert. Um, we put together a little setup in the mill just to do a test cut. And the only reason we wanted to do this is to now check repeatability of this uh, hill coupling chucking system. So now, as you can see, this has not been taken off yet since it's been cut. So the outer diameter is correspondingly perfectly concentric, which makes sense. But if we were to take this off and then put it back on, any difference in runout will then be uh, visible and tell us how repeatable this, this chuck is. It might not go to the same number necessarily when we put it back on because this gauging setup isn't perfect. Um, but if there's zero run out when we put it back on, that's how we know that it's uh, repeated well. So let's try it here. Loosen the drill bar. I'm not going to take it all the way off, but now it's clearly disengaged from the coupling faces. Tighten it back up. Spin. Wow. There is a zero indicator movement.